Welcome back to this Let's Play of The Last Remnant. Last time we did a lot of running around to complete a very basic quest. Um, that scabbard you pick up from that last quest is very important because without it you will not get a, an item later on. Anyway, the uh, grandma's girl here is telling you there's a, a no dangerous old man wandering around and uh, you should probably uh, go and check out on him. We're going to Lava Fender, where we haven't... I mean, I ran through here very briefly before, but... Uh, if you were really that close to lava, you'd be kind of toasty, so... And I don't have the map for this area, so I'm going to have to kind of work my way through. It's kind of strange these guys are sitting here and there's, no mo there's monsters around. And yeah, there's just some random bandits here that attack us. And they talk about a psycho old man. Well, I guess it's probably the old man we're looking for. This, uh, that's, uh, green and white thing is a member of the Wyvern family. Um, we'll end up fighting a couple of them soon enough, but uh, I'm not going to mess with it for now. The path that I'm running is actually also the path that takes you to where the map is. Um, I think I actually accidentally showed it earlier uh, when I was trying to my make my way past some vultures back here. But... There's like more bandits. And they say the old man's after a sword, which we kind of knew, but... It may actually be the sword that you find off of him later. Yeah, we'll run into this old man again. I guess that's... Oh, spoiler! Oh no! Just 
I'm just having a little fun with these attacks from afar, but I don't think they'll come up because I think they're probably gonna die. Probably. Huh. Sweet! I know I'm good. And fighting, you know, weak enemies like that, I don't, you know, I get a, I'm getting some bonuses, but uh, not nearly as many as I get from fighting just single hard enemies. And I think that uh, you essentially increase in battle rank based on number of enemies fought really much more than uh, quality of enemies fought. So fighting okay, a lot of low quality enemies is just, you know, increasing the battle rank of the enemies you're fighting. Ooh, that bird almost caught me. Now we can run by this guy. That chest in the back is not the sword. That sword is sitting in front of the chest. Um, and if you come here earlier, um, the sword is not here. All there is is the chest with the map. And there's no way you can walk out of here with a sword, even if you defeat the old man. And, uh, we'll give it a shot. Um, no, I guess he's not in the fight yet. More of these trashy bandits. These ones aren't as, as trash. I mean, it's maybe it's just a slightly larger group. So it's four groups rather than all these two and three groups. Less damage from Eclipse. Sweet! Yeah, well, I got battle rank. Well, well, I'm I'm stronger than guess I'm not seen out quite yet. I feel stronger well, at least we got some, you know, better stat bonuses out of that. Okay, here's the last one. Apparently the sword was killing anyone who got close to it, but this old man seems to have no problem. And, uh, well, let's just f say this fight might, be a little, might get a little interesting, but hey, you know, better interesting than boring. We're gonna go after Milton here, before he burns down the building. Milton Waddams? Yeah, no, this is not Milton Waddams. He's a little more dangerous. Well, I don't know. Milton Waddams caused no shortage of property damage. Now, Milton is sort of an annoying opponent. And this is not the last time we will fight him. His shtick is that anyone he hits dies. He just does basic attacks. Those basic attacks are instantly lethal. And th they just kill the target of the attack. He doesn't actually do damage. He just does, you know, death. Fortunately, he seems to be having accuracy issues. troop has been doing over here, but... Huh. I don't know what they're doing over here. Oh, they attacked from a distance, and I guess the, uh, the fight moved away from them. Oh. Well. 
So, see Maddox there, he just... He got hit, and he went down. Actually, he seems to be quite effective at uh, hitting the party leaders. Which is very dangerous, because if he kills all of my party leaders, everybody will be botched, and nobody will have, essentially, the option of resurrecting. Which is awkward. So I guess it's a good thing that Gauss here is a little bit off. So all of them, my unions, are listed as can't act, botched. And botched ran also sometimes randomly means that your attacks fail. So the Union will do just random things. You can't give them orders, but at least you can, you know, do something. Oh, there goes Milton. Now we just need to clean these bandits up, and they are. You don't really get very much for defeating Milton there. Normally he will fight, you actually help him fight the bandits. But if you uh, defeat him, you get a little extra gold points. For the, you know, amount of uh, additional herbs I'm using, maybe that's, you know, bad economically, but... And we hit battle rank 12. I hope I've grown stronger than before. I guess it's not too bad. I must surpass my mother. And uh, we get quite a lot of gold for winning that fight. And even though we defeated him in battle, he's still sitting there going, you know, screwing around. And then he just disappears. And unfortunately, so do we. We can't get the map that's sitting right there in front of us. Oh well, we'll get it eventually. And, you know, she's talking about the old man being okay. Yeah, I beat him up, but um, he's okay. Anyway, we have to talk to the Ryushin soldier here to get access to the next quest which all these Salia items I've been picking up are actually finally going to be useful. And they're requesting uh, the various items. I'm trying to remember where I get meteorite. We now have a couple people looking for that. Before I actually go into the aqueducts, I'm probably going to try and do some weapon upgrades. But here, Priam, you know, Paris is, you know, um, Child Molester Perry is uh, here. He's actually the son of the Duke of Royosha. But anyway, we'll deal with this next time because we're out of time.